Welcome to Ask WBK. I am the man in question here answering your questions. Today's question comes from YouTube, specifically Angelo Terabe. Angelo left a comment, and here's what the comment says. Hey, can I ask you what you do as far as materials, i.e. top loaders, sleeves, envelopes, shipping box, in reference to whatnot, talking about selling cards on whatnot, but I will use this as a chance to talk about where to buy the cheapest supplies to sell cards, trading cards, that kind of stuff, uh, because it is kind of a in-demand question. Certainly, if you do this, you want to know the answer. So here's the first thing, and you're not going to like to hear this. You're not going to want to buy in the cheapest way possible. And I'm not saying it's low quality because I don't really see a difference between like Ultra Pro and Pro Safe top loaders. They're pretty much all made in China. I think they're all made in China. I don't know. That being said, how do you buy direct from the source? Well, you'd buy a pallet of top loaders from China. Uh, I don't know how many are on a pallet. My guess is that there are 72,000 on a pallet. I don't know. Just based on, uh, I buy them by the thousand pack and they're just like cartons of their cases of cartons. I don't know. There's a lot of ways to describe. It. So this is how big a thousand case of pro safe top loaders is. It is nine by seven by 16. And this is how big a 10,000 case of penny sleeves it is. Uh, and as you can tell right there, um, it's just a different size. So I'm, I'm assuming that this would go probably 10 or 12 stacks high. Uh, probably still, you're gonna have 10 on the ground, not 12 because they're a bit wider. So you're probably looking at a million penny sleeves in a pallet, which is gonna run you oh, <laughs> at a, you know half a penny per, like again, five grand. I do not know what the actual rates are. I'm just going off the advertised rates on Alibaba. Maybe they'll cut you a deal if you buy a million top loaders and 10 million penny sleeves, but that's just so many that we're gonna ignore that. Realistically speaking, you can get one top loader for between like eight and 12 cents. If you're buying like the 25 packs at Walmart, you're paying about 20 cents per top loader. So the cheapest rate, I think, and the best deal is to buy a thousand on eBay. There are a bunch of sellers and they're all competing around the same price. I think right now the going rate is like $88. It might be down in a month, might be up in a month, don't really know, but I doubt it goes above 130, and I really seriously doubt it goes below like 70. When you're buying envelopes, you wanna get these Mead number eight envelopes, uh, 80 pack. I got it from Walmart, I think, for a dollar. Um, they're very cheap. You're paying about a penny, a penny and a half per uh, envelope. You can get them for half a penny if you uh, search out auctions online, but they are infrequent. Uh, so when you see like 10,000 go on auction, bid up to, what is that, 50 bucks? Um, maybe 100 bucks even because you're paying the same price as you would at Walmart or Dollar General or wherever. Uh, but pretty much that's a fixed price. Then the shipping box. So for shipping boxes, if you're selling cards, you don't have to have them in a box. Uh, if they're just singles, if there are lots of cards or you just want to have them in a box because you want to be sure it's safe or secure, your cheapest bet for one-offs is Walmart. They sell a 6 by 6 by 6 box for about $0.60, cents, and that's extremely close to the wholesale price. I think that their boxes are loss leaders at their stores. I'm not sure. I would just guess. Because if you buy a 1,000 6 by 6 by 6 boxes from like a box supplier, when freight's added into it and all that stuff's added into it, you're still paying close to that same price. Just cardboard is getting more expensive every year. Thanks for watching. Hope it was helpful and I'll see you guys later. And if you have any questions, put them in the comments below, put them on my TikTok. There's a thousand ways to contact me and I'll do my best to answer all of them in videos like this.